Hey you guys, welcome back to the Rally C channel. I see some familiar faces here. I, I'm kidding, it's, it's a camera. Well, I never thought I'd be unboxing an Apple Watch Series 5 because, well, you saw me about a year ago review this Series 4. Uh, if you haven't seen that video, go watch it right up there. It's a pretty good video, in my opinion. Yeah, well, the other day I woke up and it wouldn't turn on. Uh, I put it on the charger. I tried, like, holding these two buttons and nothing. And your boy doesn't buy Apple Care. He lives a risky life like a man. So I took it to Geek Squad and they said, and they couldn't even run a diagnostic on it. So they said either it's the battery or it's the logic board that just shorted out. So I don't know, I have an appointment with Apple in a couple days here, but I said to hell with it and I got a series five and that's why I have a job. So this packaging is exactly the same as my uh, series four. In fact, they actually discontinued the series four because of how similar the series five is. I think the only real big new feature on the series five is that it has an always on display. Um, so yeah, we're gonna check this out. I got the same color, uh, this space gray um, with the black band. So we got the easy pull tab right here. The packaging is literally the exact same from the outside. Um, 3D Apple watch engraved in the box there. Just lift these up and out. And there we have the beautiful packaging with all the different colored uh, watches and watch bands got that and then of course the black sport loop but inside this apple watch box here of course we have the watch the watch the computer part of it right here uh some paperwork the brick and charger not that important in this little seal i got the 44 millimeter size um, but in this little packaging, it looks literally the exact same. Literally the exact same. Literally the exact same. I don't think there's anything different about it except of the name and it has an always on display. And, uh, uh, uh. I even got the only the GPS version. It doesn't have the cellular. I didn't want to pay it extra. And we should see an Apple logo. It works. I've been working. Apple Watch again. I'm so happy. So I'm gonna get this set up and I'll let you know what I think. Well guys, I'm back after the quick 10 minute, 15 minute setup and uh, it's right here. It's on right now as uh, has an always on display. When I lift it up here, it brightens. It comes towards the screen a little more and there it is. I made a brand new um, custom face here. Um, you can see it just dims away. Uh, but it's always on. You can always see that time. I also put my old uh, magnetic band on there. Just like, again, this is basically the same exact watch as the Series 4. And I really think I'm going to like it. Hopefully it doesn't fail on me this time. Another thing about the Series 5 is that it has a built-in compass. So there is the compass app, sure enough. It says compass app can only be affected by some metal bands. Ooh, that works pretty nice. This is the only watch that has that built into it now, as it can tell, even without your phone. But yeah, guys, there's just a quick look at the Apple Watch Series 5. Uh, let me know if you guys want an in-depth tutorial on, on some of the features of Apple Watch Series 5. I know most of you know how to use an Apple Watch, but um, let me know if you want something more. Otherwise, that's going to be it for today's video. But make sure you drop a like so I know you like the video and uh, I should keep making more. And uh, subscribe if you're new. It keeps me going too. And I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.